Congratulations, Dylan. How satisfying is it to get such a big win on the road? Yeah, it's a, it's a good win. Um, obviously, it's a bit of a challenge flying over to Perth and, and getting the job done here in, a hostile, in front of a hostile crowd, but, um, you know, wrapped with the result tonight. And, yeah, there's a bit of satisfaction there, but I learned from a young age to never be satisfied and, and get ready for next week. You lost a lot of the key stats statistically, but do you feel like you still had a lot of control over most of the game? Yeah, yeah. I haven't really gone through the statistics yet. Obviously, um, we'll go through that when we need to, but um, that's sort of been the way we play. Um, we're not really too, too concerned about the statistics or KPIs. Um, we've got our, our own KPIs that we need to hit, and um, like I said, we'll go through them and, and uh, address them if we need to. You just had the team meeting. What was the main message from Wusha? Uh, well, we actually had uh, Adam Gilchrist in the meeting, so it was mostly about him um, and his uh, <laughs> his appearance. So, uh, thank you, Andrew, for that. Um, but yeah, it was, it was just um, you know get ready. We've got a six-day turnaround to to play Collingwood at the G. Um, obviously, we've secured a final spot, which is um, fantastic for the club. But the, the job's not done yet. Take us through the feeling of the club this week after last week's game. Were you confident that you could really bounce back the way you did? Oh look! After a game like that, you never you never know. Like it's it's uh, it was a pretty bad loss for the in the club's history, but um, really really impressed with the the club and the playing group. Um, <laughs> it's getting a blackout here, yeah. <laughs> but we're able to keep pretty consistent with our review and our standards uh, through the week, and we prepared for you know tonight's game like any other game. Do you feel personally like you're playing with a lot of confidence at the moment? And was it nice to hit the scoreboard as well again? Yeah, it's not always nice to hit the scoreboard. Um, obviously, we've got. A lot, of, uh, a lot of personnel down in terms of our best 22 and a lot of scoring power down. So, yeah, everyone's going to take up a bit of slack and, and try and do their, their job. Big debut today on the big stage for Brandon Zerk Thatcher, the late inclusion. What did you make of his game? Yeah, obviously, he's um, got a bit of Dustin Fletcher about him, doesn't he? He's very rangy and seemed just to have those go-go uh, -go gadget arms getting, in, getting the fist in. So, um, yeah, super, super happy for him and his family. Um, it's a big moment playing your first game and... Gee, I wish I could have played that like that in my first game. Yeah, it was pretty impressive. Looking forward to another big game next week against Collingwood. Yeah, of course. Uh, you know the arch rivals at the MCG, the home of footy. So, um, yeah, it's going to you know play a part in um, in how we finish in the finals. So, yeah, I'm going to be excited for it. Well, good luck and thanks very much for your time. Thank you.